It's time to leave Dead Horse and the Prudhoe Bay area. Yesterday we had a beautiful day to visit the Arctic Ocean and today it's 45 cold and rainy. This is probably how it is like most of the time, this overcast weather. Yesterday was like 65 or maybe even warmer and it was like sunny, just like beautiful. But today is actually how it really is up here. Just dark and gray. Dark and gray and rainy Overcast, a lot. Overcast, yeah. cold. It's definitely cool that we got such a nice day for the Arctic Ocean. But it's time for us to head out and slowly make our way back to Fairbanks and continue our Alaska journey. We're saying bye to Dead Horse and we're leaving it behind. And that's it, that's the end of Dead Horse. Last buildings right here. And now there won't be anything for a long time until cold food pretty much. And emptiness once again on the road. There's a huge herd of caribou. There's so many of them. They keep going back too. And there's some in the front also. Oh, wow. There's a bunch over there too, look. That is a lot. That's like a couple hundred caribou. This is actually a huge herd. It just keeps going in the back. All those little dots. It's insane. There's caribou everywhere. We're starting to cross the road. It's a whole herd crossing the road and they keep going back there for miles. The top of the tundra melts a little bit like a foot or a foot and a half. So it's wet and you can hear their feet making little stomping noises and they snort and this is our camper right here and they're just crossing the road right in front of the camper that's so cool there's some crossing behind our camper and there's some crossing in front of our camper so we are stuck in a hole Herd of caribou crossing. Babies. Little Look at that babies. Baby over there. This is just crazy. We did not expect this to happen today for sure. That's so cool.
baby. just right outside a dead horse we came upon a humongous herd of caribou and they've been crossing the road back and forth Eating it's just grass, been incredible yeah. to witness and i can't believe we were here to see it they were walking like in front of the truck and camp from behind just like five ten feet away it was just crazy so cool look at them they're crossing the road over there they're all over on this side on the other side of the road i don't know how many but it's hundreds of them there's all kinds too, babies, one with ginormous horns, females, males. It's just so cool to see. Can't believe it. Just a normal day, dry in the Arctic. It's a bear. I think that's a bear out there. The black dot that you see out in the distance, I think that's a bear. Cause it's moving. No, that's not a bear. Muskox? Mm-hmm. <gasps> muskox? Or a bison. No way! Yeah, so there's a muskox over there, and then right in front of us, a bear. there's a bear on the road. No, don't go away. Scared. One yesterday, he was laying by the side of the road. He was just sleeping. You think you're this one got us scared. So there's a grizzly running over there and a group of muskox running over here. Man, the muskox run so fast. Yeah. For something so huge. muskox saw the bear they, they're kind of hesitating and pausing now and kind of walking our way now and the bear just floored it he started running when he saw the muskox <laughs> so they're he both, ran across the street he's they're, gone they're both scared of each other or something yeah they're both scared of each other i mean the muskox had a group before the bears by itself yeah but they all oh look how fast they're going to but yeah the bear when he saw our truck, he ran off like slowly, but then when he saw the muskox, he like ran full speed. Yeah. That was really fast. He cleared the whole field in like a minute or something. Yeah. That was crazy. So yeah, you can't outrun that bear. <laughs> it was galloping like a horse. So we left that horse. We have been driving for three and a half hours and we only got like two miles done in those three and a half hours. That's because first, 
we got trapped in a giant herd of uh, caribou. So we stood there and watched them for a long time. Then after we drove past them, we came upon a bunch of um, muskox and we have been watching them for a while. Then we also came upon a bear. We were watching him for a while. take a little clip and pictures of the midnight sun here and the Arctic, the Alaskan tundra, where the sun does not set for two months out of the year. It's 12.30 at night right now and the sun is not even close to the horizon yet. <laughs> 